Hey, what's up, guys? In this video, we're going to be doing a gameplay of the three star of Mortal Iron Fist. Um, I really. I've had this guy for, for a while, and I probably should have done a video sooner. But, yeah, this character is very plain. And it's basically just Iron Fist, with I think, like, his armor breaks work a different way, but. I've never really used the Mortal Iron Fist, the Gold Iron Fist, White Iron Fist, whatever you want to call. So I just want to see what it feels like as a three star maxed out. So yeah, um, this first fight. Also, we have the suicides on, and we also have like a synergy with Nick Fury to make our crit rating higher for the first ten seconds of the fight. But with this guy, I think you can stack up armor breaks. I think, as you see, we have four, five, six. So I think that's how you play this character, but. So far, um, I'm not hitting too hard, but you also gotta remember we're um, only a three star and we have class disadvantage. And I think this Hulk has like 90% like physical resistance or sign. So yeah, this fight normally is pretty long. Special two doesn't feel as strong. Yeah, if we don't crit, it's just really fucking weak, these hits. Yeah, we just need to crit a little bit more. This is really painful. I don't think they have special three, right? I'm like 99% sure they don't have their special three on in this quest. Okay, yeah. Except for like Maestro. This is definitely going to be the worst fight. Actually, maybe, maybe Magic will be pretty shit. We might die to Magic. Because I don't have that mastery that reduces ability accuracy on parry. So, yeah, we're probably going to die in that fight. But this fight's definitely going to be the longest fight. We're 100 hits in now, and he's almost down. We're already at 50% health. He is kind of squishy, though. And his block proficiency isn't too high, I'm pretty sure. But, yeah. Come on, hope. Uh, it's fine, we have a shit ton of low level potions, and yeah, it's not that bad. So, like 120 hits, that fight was very long. Um, we have the Nick Fury heal synergy, evade synergy, and crit synergy. So, basically, every synergy that Nick Fury has. Okay, we got ambushed. This guy has 19,000 health, so theoretically, shouldn't take that long. Let's see a normal fight, class advantage, and um. Yeah, no physical resistance, so we're already hitting a lot harder. I have no idea what special this dude has though, so that's going to be interesting to find out. So I think the armor breaks are just RNG based, so we have four right now, so it's Iron Man. Yeah, he's dead. That fight was like six times faster, which is very nice. So yeah. Next we got Captain America. Um, he has the parry mastery for some reason, but okay. It's very nice. The level two health potions, you know, for me when I use my six star rank two, six star rank threes, max out five stars, they literally like do nothing. I could use all 25 and it would barely do anything. But on a three star, they actually do something. So that's cool. I don't know why he evaded there. I'm like 99% sure I was holding block, but okay. But we're hitting pretty decent right now, honestly. Our mediums, Critting him for a 940 on special 2, and then he's dead. Yeah, these fights are actually feeling pretty nice. Um, pretty nice when he doesn't have the physical resistance. Uh, let me just turn on. So I gotta turn on notifications. Someone just texted me. Um, but I probably edited it out or like blacked the screen. So right now I got this magic. Um, I should have definitely healed up for this, but. Hopefully she doesn't get limbo and she does cool actually if we stack up a lot of um armor breaks then um, It could negate the healing um, with the despair mastery, but That doesn't seem to be happening If she got limbo again Surprisingly this fight's a lot um going a lot better than I thought it would be going So that's cool. Let's launch a special two and finish this nice Special 2 hits hard. Definitely hits hard. Indeed. Pretty fun. Um, next we got Ronin. 
Yeah, that Hulk fight took so long. They did like 90% physical resistance. And he also... Well, we were also class disadvantaged, so... Yeah. I like the synergy with Nick Fury to make you crit a lot in the beginning. That's pretty cool. Look how hard. Look, our mediums are in for... What was that? 1,200 when they crit? That's pretty nice. 1,283. Alright, come on. On to the special two. So pretty much all these fights are dying by special two at this point. So his damage is definitely pretty nice. Decent damage output, decent. But also I do have suicides on, so it is definitely helping. But we have no synergies that make his attack higher. We have the crit synergy to make him crit more in the beginning, but no more extra, not like any extra damage. But this crit synergy is very nice, I can say that. Look at all these crit, look at that combo. That was, oh shit. I'm gonna evade synergy, save my ass. Uh, combo is nice. You have six armor breaks. Don't throw a special. Alright, look at that. That's nice. Oh no, of course he doesn't die. What special does this guy have? Oh, Scarlet Witch. Okay. Fine, fine. So. Let's go to the next fight, Gamora. He does have a, um. Let me see. He does have an ability. Oh, let me see. Um. Oh yeah, heavy attacks. They can stop cruelty, fury, and precision. Or they can nullify it. So I was thinking like, if you have a six star, like rank three, okay? Just say, <laughs> I say you do have that, okay? You could theoretically use him for rage nodes. I'm not saying he'd be the best option. I think he'd be far from it. But if you get to like four furies, you could just throw a heavy and nullify them. So they never get to five furies, which could be cool. But yeah, that Gamora fight was actually destruction. Yeah, he, he feels very nice when they don't have crazy physical resistance. If he could nullify any buff from his heavy attack, I think it would make him a lot better. Like, it's just it's make him nullify any buff. Any buff in the entire game. Regeneration, armor up, like anything. So, um, this fight isn't too bad because we can block out a lot of the healing with the armor breaks. For with despair. So that is nice. Look at that. We're at six armors. Seven. Look at this. He can't even regen, bro. Okay, well, we got kind of shit luck there. But look at that. He's regenerating barely as much as he would be because of the despair mastery. That's pretty nice. That's a good fight. That's a good fight. He has a lot of armor up, so you probably won't be able to get to seven, but you can get like four or five most of the time. So, he can block out regen pretty decently. Not fully, but take a good chunk out of it. I don't think anyone's going to be using this guy for questing, though. Um, if you have him as a 5 or 6 star. Maybe for, like, the memes, but... He's basically just an Iron Fist, I'm, I'm thinking. But he's, like, a flex version of Iron Fist. Because he's gold. And it's very rare to get this guy. Fun fact, I pulled the 4-star and the 3-star Mortal Iron Fist on the same day. It was pretty weird. Um, so I do have a 4-star Mortal Iron Fist, but he's not awakened. So if I get some, if I get like a 4-star generic Awakening Gem or something, I'll use him in him. I'll take him to rank 5. That'll be a cool gameplay video. Let's use some health potions on this guy. I, I, I've never seen level 1 health potions actually do anything. It's so rare. So that's one nice thing about using the 3-star. So now let's see how he goes up against Maestro. Um, if Maestro special one hits me, like I'm just dead, and I really am bad at evading it. I'm not bad at evading it, but it's been last time I tried to evade a special one was in Labyrinth, and I 100% Labyrinth like two years ago. So yeah, I have not evaded this guy's specials in a while. I'm just gonna try to push him to special two as much as possible. So that's the strat. Hopefully this gets him over the edge, it does, nice. The damage so far is pretty decent. His armor breaks are nice. He is like an Iron Fist though, so he has one of the lowest health pools in the game. Oh, the evade saved me from that last hit. I tried to dex out of it when the evade saved me. That's so clutch, dude. Nick Fury synergy, god mode. That's 
this is very nice. Very nice indeed. Also, we're losing a lot of health because I think this fight is permanent heal block. So, oh shit. So, um, we're not regening. We're just taking damage from suicide. So, we got to try to finish this a little bit faster. Oh no, I think suicides are going to kill us. Oh no, dude. Kill him. Go for it. No! Well, I died. Um, that was very tragic. If he didn't have the heal block thing, heal branch, we would have won that fight, but that's very sad. Um, yeah, I don't really care to finish this fight off. You basically saw what his damage was. Um, at the end of the day, I think we all know he's just a trophy champ, but he is cool to have Warline Fist. He's very rare, but I'll show you. I do have the four star also. Um, I think his awakening ability is kind of important, so I'm gonna wait to awaken this guy somewhat, just because it looks nicer too with the silver stars. And when I do, I'll rank five him. We can do gameplay with him just for the flex once again. But yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give a like, comment, subscribe. More Iron Fist, pretty cool character. Not really, he's just basically Iron Man, Iron Fist, but. He's a cool trophy champ to have, I'll tell you that. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give a like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.